Hey guys, so this video is going to be a Target haul. So if you watched my last video, you probably know my boyfriend and I went to Syracuse for the weekend. So we left on Friday and we came back on Saturday night, kind of. Um, so yeah, we just went shopping. We were supposed to go to the zoo. But then um, the first day on Friday, we didn't have time to do like all the stores because this mall is huge. And my boyfriend was like, well, maybe we can come back tomorrow. I was like, okay. So I didn't really mind um, shopping two days in a row. Um, so yeah, we shopped two days and um, we came back. So it was really fun, we had a lot of fun. But before going to the Destiny USA Mall in Syracuse, I wanted to go to Target before because I wanted to get some swimsuits, swimsuits, because in two weeks I'm going to Cuba, so I wanted some swimsuits, and I heard Target, there's a lot of cute swimsuits there. So we went in there, didn't find anything, so I went to the makeup aisle because I wanted to get a few things because it's a lot cheaper in the States and in Canada, drugstore products, so yeah, I got um, and find a few things that I've been wanting here, but that I just never purchased. Um, there's actually not a lot of products, so don't get too excited, it's going to be very short. It's just I didn't want to mix my Target haul with my haul, like everything else, because everything else is kind of a lot, and I didn't want to make the video too long, and I wanted to, to keep the beauty products drugstore beauty products out of this haul. So anyways, I will start. Also, we're getting a Target soon in um, my area where I live. So beginning of fall, Target should open. And every time I'm passing by the Target, I'm like, oh my gosh, it's like it's getting there. You know, I can see. I think they started to, I don't know, like the interior seems like it's done kind of. So yeah, the outside is pretty much done too. See, I'm really excited for Target. I don't know why, because it's like a Walmart, like a Zillers. We used to have Zillers, but now Target bought Zillers. Um, or something like that. Um, like, it's nothing exciting, but to me it's exciting. I don't know. Okay, so first thing I got is the Aussie uh, Moist 3 Minute Miracle. I heard so many great things about this, about this, about this, but for some reason, we had the brand Aussie um, in Quebec. It's just, I can never find this uh, particular product. So I used it today, just took my, it was the first time I was using it. Um, I took my shower this morning. My hair is still wet. By the way, if you see it, so what? Um, so I cannot really tell you. I didn't put anything in my hair after. Usually I put a cream in my hair after. I just wanted to see how my hair would feel just by, with only with this product. So my hair feels soft. I need to cut it though. So, I mean, obviously it won't help too much with my split ends. But, I mean, my hair feels soft. So, yeah, I'm excited to try this more. Um, I'm really glad I got it. It was really cheap. It was like two something three something I don't know it was really cheap okay and then I just got a toothbrush because I forgot mine and my boyfriend had toothpaste then I just forgot my brush toothbrush so I just got one okay um and now I got um the big eyes well it's actually the falsies big eyes mascara so there's actually not a lot of product in there um and I like really like the falsies it's mascara I've used so many uh, tubes of that one, but for some reason this time I didn't like it so much. It I ran out pretty quick and it just didn't make my lashes look that great, but I'm really impressed with that one. Um, like I said, there's not a lot of product and I knew this was like the Falsies Big Eyes, so it was just like another version, so I was like, I'm probably going to like it. And I really do like it, so it first comes, and I don't have, like I said in my Get Ready With Me video, I don't have really pretty lashes, like really curled lashes. Um, so, but this one, I don't know if you can tell, but it makes my lashes look pretty good. So, there is, um, on one side, this is the brush for your upper lashes. And then, for bottom lashes, is this one. Which, I got this one in very black, non-waterproof, because I've been wearing waterproof mascara for about a year. And it just, it's so hard to remove at night, I just, I couldn't do it anymore. Like, my lashes would... I don't know. I just decided to get a non-waterproof version this time, but then I'm going to Cuba in two weeks. I will need waterproof mascara. But uh, so far, I wore it three times, maybe, um, since I have it. I really like it. It makes my lashes look good, to my in my opinion. Um, so, yeah. Um, yeah, I wanted to do a first impression on this, but I just needed the new mascara. I mean, needed, like, right away, so... Um, but also if you want a tutorial on this makeup 
look. I will probably do one, but I've been liking to put on eyeshadows lately, so that's good. Because I can stop for a while, so maybe you'll see a tutorial for that. So I got this, it was six something, I don't know. Okay, then I got a Revlon lip gloss, which these are like the new ones, how are they called? Revlon Super Lustrous. So it, I think they still have the square packaging one. But anyways, this is like the new ones. I got mine in 215 Supernatural. Um, I wanted to get like the burgundy, really deep, dark plum color, but then I just decided to get this one because it's a lot more natural. And for glosses, I like dark lipsticks, but I'm not really... I When I wear like a red or a really dark color, I don't like it to be shiny. I don't know. So I just decided to get this one because when I wear a nude lipstick, I like to have gloss on top. So yeah, it's a really pretty color. Um, it's not so much on the pink side, it's more of on the nude side. But I really like it. I don't want to do a swatch because it will just be disgusting on my hand and I will wipe it somewhere. Um, but yeah, I really like this color. I'm probably going to wear it in my next video. This and my lipstick from Rimmel. This video is getting long. I'm really sorry. Okay. Now this is what I have on my lips right now. Again, I wanted to do first impression on that, but, um, sorry. I wanted to do a first impression, but then I was just too excited. But I'm probably still going to be doing a demo, how I wear it, how long it lasts. Like a first impression video, but third impression, something like that. Um, so I was excited to get this because in Canada they're pretty expensive. I, I just, I wanted to get it, but then it was $9.99. I was like, no. So this is 187 Infinite Fuchsia. And I, I don't know, I don't want to talk too much about it, but it looks like this. It doesn't smell, it smells a little something, but it's the Carré Shine um, Lip Stains from L'Oreal. So yeah, I'm excited to do a video about that. Let me know if you want one. Um, yeah, and then the last thing I got, as I said, it's not going to be a long video. It's the Fit Me Foundation Shine Free Fit Me Shine Free Foundation. I got it in the shade 115. So it's a stick foundation. Um, I really like the Fit Me Foundations. And so I was excited to try this one because it's different. It's a stick. I never tried a stick foundation before, so I was excited to try it. And yeah, I'll see how I like it. Maybe again, I'm going to do a video about this to show you how I apply it, how it long and lasts, and what it does on my skin, because I have pretty dry skin, I would say, ex ex especially especially now I've been, not oily, maybe it's the summer, but I've been looking a lot more dewy, if I can say, so, yeah, anyways, um, I will tell you how I feel about this, probably make a video, so, yeah, this is everything I got from Target, it's not a lot, I don't want to go too overboard in Target, because I knew I was going to spend a lot in the actual mall so if you're excited to see what i got in the cine usa mall then um my next video will be my haul so yeah anyways i hope you enjoyed this and i will see you in my next video okay bye